Good morning, guys. Ah, good fucking morning. Intra workout drink is ready. Today it's EAAs and Costadextrin. <coughs> I made it a little too sweet. Yeah. All right, so back day today. I weighed myself this morning 124.6 so again up another 600 grams it's getting a little I think I'm getting too pumped almost last week today I was let me check real quick Ah, last week today, I was 117.4, so I gained 7 kilos, that's a little much, is it, oh the battery is almost empty, so let me start the workout, I'm gonna plug the camera in, and then we get straight to it. So, this obviously was a warm-up. Today we're going to make a change, because I feel like my chest has gotten a lot better lately, over those past few weeks, and the thing I have changed in my chest training is I've done less exercises, but more sets of, an exercise, of the exercises that I feel really well. And for back, I'm still doing always seven movements. And some of them, I don't really know where I feel them. So, I'm gonna make an experiment here, cut down to five exercises maybe. I'll, go, I'll just roll with it today. Five, maybe six exercises and just do the ones I really like and I can really pile drive into the muscle I want to. I'm definitely gonna cut out rec deadlifts today because I've been uh, rec deadlifting twice a week. I've been squatting free weight once a week and then I've, I've done the RDLs once a week also. So that is a lot of lower back loading and it's getting to me i gotta be honest my lower back is it's not hurting but it's i feel it's not recovering and tomorrow i would have to do the squats again i will have to do the squats again i want to do the squats again and last week i did that and i really felt it in my lower back so so last week i deadlifted today and then squatted tomorrow and i felt it in my lower back so definitely today i'm gonna I dropped the rack deadlift to be 100% for the squats tomorrow and instead do more sets of like the uh, cable row and the barbell row and 
dumbbell row and this one here so my lower back doesn't get as fatigued all right so let's warm up one more time and then hit the working weight It almost went on me. Holy fuck. Okay, so what we're doing here is, as you saw, instead of four regular sets, I'm doing three doubles. So, doesn't matter how many reps I do, it's left arm, right arm, left arm, right arm, break. 
Left arm, right arm, left arm, right arm. Break. I feel that way more than both arms at the same time, to be honest. So two more sets of this. And then it's on to the next exercise, which honestly I haven't decided yet. <laughs> strength drops quick on this one You get it, right? You don't have to see three sets.
This is the exercise I hate the most. <laughs> But those are the ones you have to do. My left arm is way weaker here. So from now on I'm going to start out with the left arm. And just do as many as I, as many as I can. And then with the right arm, I will just exactly match that number. Because right now I got 13 on the right and then 11 on the left. Pisses me off. All right. I gotta leave a little longer break. Oh. Okay, that's long enough.
Okay, folks. Next exercise here. You see how we do the, the barbell rows. That was four sets there. So now, seated cable. Again, four sets. And I'm doing four sets of 12 here because once it gets harder, I just set it down for longer. You will see what I mean. But I have to get 12. I can't let go of the handle before I reach 12. No matter how long, I have to rest it. And that's really painful. First set might seem easy, right? And then the second set is harder, the third set is brutal, and the fourth set you're like barely hanging on. So, this is set number three. One more. <sighs> okay guys, so last set here. Last set, last exercise. Okay, since that was it, taking you right over to the post-workout, post-training, supplementation. As always, magnesium, 10 caps, 10. Almost lost one. <coughs> See, my chest got better. 
three cortisol blocking agents ashwagandha and phosphate dilzerin three of them and 10 grams of good old glutamine And that's it. Big minus zone punkt D, code Rex 10. So guys, I got a couple deliveries here today. This is an awesome one. I think the lighting isn't that great, but fuck it. So this is a really cool one. Das habe ich bekommen vom Flair. Also Flizzy, danke. Ich hoffe, das ist meine Größe, Mann. Ich hoffe, das ist meine Größe. Alright. Also. Ja. Das ist alles so groß, wie es geht. Aber richtig cool sieht es aus. Die Marke von Flair. Maskulin. Boom. Jetzt hat man auch meine Adresse gesehen, aber scheiß drauf, steht auch auf meiner Webseite. Erstmal hier die Frucht, die am tiefsten hängt, Trucker Cap. Ich stehe auf sowas. Ich habe so einen großen Kopf, manchmal passen mir die nicht. Richtig cool. Ja, Mann. Geht sogar noch größer. Okay. Yep. Approved. Dann geht's weiter. Ein Haufen anderes Zeug. Ich finde es richtig geil. Zumindest. Wow, das hier, dieses Tanktop hatte ich ja schon im letzten Video an. Das habt ihr schon gesehen. Ich kann vielleicht mal das Foto einblenden, wenn ich dran denke. Habt ihr das Foto gerade gesehen? Das ist geil. Oh, das gleiche noch in alter geil. Das ist so Baseball-mäßig. Ich will es nicht kaputt machen. Die Packung ist richtig edel. <lacht> Aber auf jeden Fall. Okay. Ja, Mann. Huhu. Ich hole jetzt erstmal alles raus und dann ziehe ich so im Laufe der nächsten Videos an. So machen wir es. Also das ist ein richtig geiles Teil, Mann. Alter. Das gleiche nochmal in weiß. Hier, was haben wir da? Sieht nach Hoodie aus. Ja, mit 3D Print. Oder mit 3D Stick sogar, nicht Print nur. Hoodie, auch richtig edel. 
Alter. Hinten auch. Boom. Au. Hier ist es. Das könnte ein T-Shirt sein. Ich glaube gar nicht, wie ich mich freue. Ich finde es echt geil, man, sowas. Vor allem ist der Style so cool. Alles so schwarz. Dann so schlichtes Design, wo nicht so viel Scheiße draufsteht. Sowas mag ich. Und der Stoff ist auch richtig edel. Ja, Mann. Print. Siebdruckprint. Also nicht diese Plastikfolie, die da drauf. Oh, und das hier ist sogar Stick. Hier im selben Stil. Aber das kommt ein bisschen größer rüber. Mit 3D Stick. Sweatshirt. Geil, Mann. Das sieht mir nach Oversize Schnitt aus. Das ist mein Ding. Hier unten noch mal ein kleines Detail. Hier Hose. Oh, da weiß ich nicht, ob mir die passt. <lacht> Ja, auch 3D Stick, selbe Qualität, alles richtig cool. Und das letzte ist noch mal ein T-Shirt. Auch 3D Stick. Ja. Boom. Geil. Cool. Wartet mal. Also, boom. Ich habe es für euch anprobiert. Was sagt ihr dazu? Sieht richtig cool aus, finde ich. Danke, Flair. Boom.